Hi. I'm going to tell the story of Sasquatch. Let's watch it away. Sure, buddy. Okay. Let me tell it. Oh, I'm a campfire, of course. That's where you always tell stories. Okay. Those are now like any other. Far away in the forest. One house is very special. There's a Sasquatch. Or Bigfoot. Or Bigfoot. Whatever you want to call him. He's still evil. He's hunting. And hunting. And hunting. And hunting. He's not the only one with a problem. Because, well, he has something to worry about. The ghost fire. He hunts around these woods. Looking for Bigfoot. He's so close. You can smell it. Bigfoot's Bigfoot. He sees him. And then closer. And closer. Until. Closer and closer until the foot runs. This is going in runs. Runs, runs, runs. I'm scared. <gasps> no one dances. Nobody does that in my woods. Uh, I can that sunlight. Turn it off. Uh, stay still. I'll stay still if, if you don't hunt for me. Fine. And never come back. Fine. So it went away forever and ever. That was the story of Bigfoot. And he lived not halfway of after. You see, he has another fear. Sharks. And... When the frog raiders, when they came on the camp, they went closer and closer and closer. And started trying try to bite him. Then... He did his little feet off and ran. And ran, ran, ran. So the shark... And he just wanted to see what the Bigfoot was. He said it. So, he went back and told the word graders. That's it, is it? You know, I forgot the story. Yeah, so did I. I was in the story, but I forgot. This is a nightmare. And it was happily ever after.